Hello, this is Barry Amaker. Thank you for joining us for Power to Press On. Well, today I'm going to share a thought with you entitled, No Questions Asked. While we were on a trip recently to Hawaii on the Kona Island, I was doing an early morning walk along the Alili Highway, and the scenery was just beautiful with the water splashing on the rocks, and it created a nice spray with the sunrise in the background. <clears throat> it was just totally amazing. But as I was walking along, I noticed on various telephone poles and fences and windows, there was a poster with a picture of a cute little dog. The dog apparently had gone missing, and the owner was reaching out for help. But what caught my eye was a $1,000 reward was listed on the poster. It says, a $1,000 reward with no questions asked for the return of this dearly loved pet. Okay, so it took a few times for me to see this poster as I was walking. Then the Holy Spirit prompted me with this thought here. That is what Jesus did for us. He gave his life on Calvary to redeem us with no questions asked. John 3.16 declares, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. That verse does not go on to ask a bunch of questions. If, why, but, where, maybe, no. Jesus came to redeem us with no questions asked. By definition, to be redeemed is the Redeemer obtains someone's release from captivity or accomplishes restoration of something by paying a ransom. Redemption begins with the fact that something is in bondage and it is fulfilled when a ransom is paid. After the ransom is paid, freedom is granted. All of us have sinned and fallen short into the bondage of sin, but Jesus has redeemed us with no questions asked. All we have to do is accept the gift of salvation. You know, Satan is the one that will be asking all the questions. He is the accuser, the deceiver, and the liar. I mean, deception is his greatest expertise. But Jesus is standing at the door. All we have to do is let him in with no questions asked. You know, the $1,000 reward that the owner was willing to pay is a lot of money, and it shows just how much he loved his pet. And I can only imagine what it will look like when the master and his pet are reunited. I can visualize the dog running excitedly into the owner's arms and jumping in there with a lot of excitement. What a celebration of that will be. How much more, though, does Jesus love us to give his life for us with no questions asked? Romans 10, 13 declares that whosoever calls on the name of the Lord shall be saved. And we can run and jump in his arms. And what a celebration that will be. Luke 15, verse 10 declares that there is joy in the presence of the angels of God over one sinner's repentance. So there you have it. You can come to Jesus today with no questions asked, and I hope you will if you have not already. Thanks for joining us today. Remember, you do have the power to press on because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world.